Hi, my name is Cindy Rang. I'm Brianna Moskitz, and today's our Wednesday box opening. <laughs> Am I taller than you? Oh, I thought I was slouching. Huh. You're wearing heels? I was feeling tall. I'm wearing heels uh -oh. for a moment. <laughs> and I'm still here. Still here. Still here. We're going to open some boxes and see in, what it is. In uh, real time, she's in watching time. this in uh, Sailor Airport. Shh. Yeah, that's true. All right, yeah, because you aren't leaving I'm until not. 9 o'clock tonight. Yeah, we don't leave. Yeah. It's a 16-hour flight, and uh, they, I think they want you to sleep much yes. of the time. Well, I mean, that's why you leave it. Nine. Right. It's the easiest way to do it. However, I have all these books. <laughs> You'll be busy. Take a nap on your way there. I started one <laughs> that I have to tell you guys about. Because I just have to tell you because there's a bit of controversy about this. It's called The September House. I have not heard of that one. Well, here's the funny thing. There's this gal that I watch that I really, really like. Um, I love her book reviews. I trust everything that she says. And then there's another one. She owns a bookstore in New York, and it's called something like... I'm going to get it wrong, secondhand reads or something like that. I really, really like her. Those are the two people that when mm -hmm. they, they're my Joan Pergola. So when they suggest a book, it's like, oh, okay, I'm going to read it. I'm going to uh -huh. put it on my list. And they're right all the time. So I like both of them. One says <gasps> September House. Yes. One says worst book she'd ever read. She does not recommend it. But it had such big reviews that they picked it as their book of the month for their book club. Oh. And she hated it. Uh -oh. And then the other gal that owns the bookstore in New York loved it. Best r book ever. Thought it was fantastic. Didn't want to spoil it. They did it as a book club. Uh -huh. Five stars all the way around. And I thought, Ooh. so I started it. I'm like in like, I'm pointing to my ears. Um, I started it and uh, in the first like five minutes of it, I thought, well, I'm not even going to finish this. Uh-oh. It is though. And then you kind of get into it because... Oh, the slow start books are hard for the me. The slow start books are hard. Just like any movie. The slow start's hard. They need to grab me within the first, like, five, ten pages. Well, she does. She tells you exactly what the book is about. And I'm thinking, oh, no, 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 no. Oh, uh, no. I'm not going to listen to this. And oh. then you realize it's kind of funny. Oh. <laughs> it's a whole. It's not what you think. So, anyway, I can't wait to talk to somebody about it. So if you're in between books, I'm not saying I recommend it. <laughs> Tell Lori. It. Lori's going I don't with really you. know. I know. Yeah. Yeah. I just want to know because now I am so intrigued oh. about it because it's not at all what you and think. It's September House. It's called September House. Okay. And at first, when you first start it, I'm going to say, you're going to go, what is this? But at, I'm at a point right now, and I think it's a 14 hour read, 14 hour listen. And I'm probably an hour in, and I've decided it's stick funny. With it. oh, okay. I've decided it's <laughs> funny, and that it was kind of like, I, uh, like ironic, not, you know. Anyway, mm, okay. I don't know. Anyway, anyway, I'm super intrigued about it. So, anyway, cool. Okay. All right. So uh, we've got lots of boxes. We actually have some boxes. A bunch of boxes. Now we're gonna. Oh, we won't have anything for Sunday at the moment, unless you know. The boys bring us something. <laughs> need to bring but some more. It'll be a good one. Who's going to open boxes with you, Tracy? I have a Tracy. Oh, I, I have a box cutter. I have a box cutter. <laughs> <laughs> I have a box cutter. Good. Yeah, I keep so, that. Um, also, open this first one. There's some big tape on here that says oh. Batik. Yes, it's Island Batik on it. It seems fitting. The last thing you're going to pet and see. Going is to the <laughs> land batik. of Batik. Rumor has it that we can buy Batiks there for like $2 a yard. But their boutique is different what, uh, than American boutique. I agree. Yeah. I mean, That's bring me I back said. the That's real stuff. That's what I said when but... I was emailing them because um, I, said, I don't think it's what we think. Yeah, of American boutique square. is far different than mm -hmm. their authentic boutiques. It is gorgeous and fantastic, but it's very different. We have a friend um, from there who has brought mm -hmm. us stuff. It's, it's really cool it's stuff. Really I love it. Yeah. Oh. Nice. A whole little array oh, of goodness. Of colors. I have actually three boxes, but they're all different. Mm. That's pretty. I love batiks. This would be a good time. I think almost every quote behind us is batik. Beautiful. Yeah. Well, no, not everyone. Oh, it made a lot of a them. A lot of them. I put that one in there. Yeah. But it's pretty. And this one's like purple and like <laughs> emerald green. Oh, that was that's really pretty. pretty. Yeah, it's really pretty. All right, let's take some noisy... <gasps> Look at that. Look. Maisie and Maisie's out here giving us the stink Did eye. your sister let you out? Yeah. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> I'm 
on. Do you want to say hi? Come here. Come here. Come on. She got all. <laughs> Come here. <clears throat> do you want to say hi to everybody? Come here. No, they don't want that. She she thinks you might want her Cheerios. Maybe her Cheerios. Maybe some Cheerios. Did you make any in your mouth? Uh, 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 you gonna say I, hi? I say hi. Can I say Ooh. hi? Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Such a silly goose. Uh, right. She's gonna help us take some plastic off so we can look at these nice up and close. Mama, can I help you? And we'll Mama. be right back. We'll be right back. Can and hard press. <laughs> yeah, you can help me. Uh, okay, this is gorgeous. These are beautiful. Her usual, but there's a really cool so, uh, color story that we don't usually have that is mm -hmm. very super unique. lovely. And we were just talking about this as we were unboxing these. Uh, both Brianna and I love batiks. We mm -hmm. are both fully addicted to batiks. And I would say, wouldn't you say probably 75% of our shop samples are batiks? Yes. We love them. We love them because... Again, fully saturated color, kind of no right or wrong, you mm -hmm. can't really make a mistake. And also, I feel like for us, when it comes to shop samples, it is fairly easily reproducible. Right. If you love that super bright red and orange, or you love that really cool blue, teal, and purple, we can pretty much get close for you. I mean, it, it all is kind of an ethereal, kind of a cool look to it. So mm -hmm. I think that's why we like it a lot. And in fact, for just a moment, let me mention a couple of things. There was two things that people asked about. Oh. One this was, was one. this flying geese uh, on the flag quilt. Y'all uh, love this fabric. <laughs> hey, what so, is this? good news, bad news. Look away. Um, <laughs> yeah, it, good news is me and my sister designs who created this fabric still designs fabric for Moda Fabrics. Bad news is it's like 15 years old. It's pretty old. So, <laughs> you probably can't find this exact stuff, but it's a me and my sister designs from Moda. Mm -hmm. um, look them up. Maybe somebody still has it. Maybe they have like a, you know, rejuvenated line that has um, daisies and dragonflies on it. I don't know, but um, their we fabric don't... pretty much all looks the same. It, yeah. You know, like most that's of those sweet designers. and plenty that we yes. showed on Sunday. That's. Them. Me and my sister, so that really bright, fun. Yeah. But this particular one, with the flowers and the dragonflies, you will teasing. not find that. Yeah, sorry. These kinds of, these fun designs, and even those colors, not Maybe. so hard. Yeah. Not, don't look for that. <laughs> um, the other one that people were asking about, I think, was this border. No, it was this border. This Ooh. border. Yeah. They said, oh, that one that you guys were showing is right. Multicolored. So I think, again, this exact one, we would not be able to find something mm -hmm. similar to this. Super easy. Uh, there's quite a few yeah. multicolored um, batiks back there. They might not have this overlay print, that chop in there, but if you like yeah. the kind of color wheel thing going on, I have a handful of them. Whether you yeah. want to go more bright or more fall, I have that. Yeah. So if you are looking for um, a that multi colored kind, border, um, email us and I'll send you over pictures. Give me a cell phone number and I can text pictures to and I'll just send you multicolored ones and you can let yeah. me know. But I, have a lot. I, I think that that's one of those that when they look um, on the website, it could be that your little one inch square yeah. might not really be a clear depiction of what all is going on in that fabric. That is true. The swatches I get directly from Island Boutique or Hoffman's website for their swatches, but I agree. I think one inch is hard to look at versus a nine by 22 mm -hmm. inch piece. And I think our boutique section is very overwhelming. There's like seven pages of boutiques. We have and the that's boutiques only our largest section in the shop in yeah. terms of shop, because again, Right, and it's hard to also say I'm looking for pink batiks because our pink one from Sunday was called Frank, <laughs> and it really is pink. Frank, like raspberry. Frank, he and I socks. checked it everywhere. He wears short socks. <laughs> on my packing slip, it was Frank. Online, it was Frank. It really is Frank. Is Frank pink in French? We're thinking there's a translation somewhere. We're missing something. Yeah. Ask Mr. Hoffman himself. Anymore. Mr. Hoffman, why was Frank pink? Is there an inside joke we need to know about? Yeah, there's something going on there. <laughs> we need to know. <laughs> so anyways, that's on. why it's also hard to search. I'm going to get the inside scoop on that. Yeah. <laughs> if you're looking for something, email us and make sure you attach a cell phone number. And I'll text you pictures. I got lots. Lots. Yeah, lots and lots. <laughs> okay. Um, and Tracy says pink in French is rose. Rose. Of course it is. Of course it is. Of course it is. 
Love it, Frank. All right. All right, so we have like two different stacks of these for you because, well, we moved all of this. We have all this room and we only give ourselves one table. (laughs) (laughs) Because the table we really want to use is not clean yet. Yeah. (laughs) You didn't have to tell him that. (laughs) Yeah. Oh, these are so, so beautiful. Oh, they look I so good. love, 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 love. Gosh, look at that just dark, dark, dark teal. I know, aren't that's dark gorgeous. teal. And look at that piece right there, the teal and purple. And these, I don't know which one of these is my favorite. I and love I have this. nothing like that. Uh-uh. These are and can you see, can you show them up close what's going on with that? So it's that really cool chop, that really cool design. But if you really look, that um, that dark color there is kind of purpley, um, tealy, emeraldy. charcoaly, emeraldy. Ah, yeah, it is a fantastic it. And it's color. kind of a banana um, yeah. color. It's not yeah, white. Yeah, parchment Yeah, it's... This is that same kind of color story, just a little different chop which is pretty cool same color story different chop a little more color on that one because Mm -hmm. there's more color down and then oh look at that i just love it a mixed background with the other ones i don't know but super cool oh i love it and look at this one this is the same chop, interestingly, as this one. Look at this. Yeah. just That is different. exactly the same chop. If you don't know what I mean by chop, stay tuned. We'll take a picture for you. It's essentially the stamp. video. It's the stamp. They actually, they do it still by hand. It's all hand done. It's so cool. I oh, love it. This is just a cool little dot piece. This is that same chop that I already showed you. Look at that one. Oh. oh. Gosh, I just love it that you, depending upon where you cut, you have a whole different little color yeah, story a really going on. really beautiful jewel tone. And I think color. that for some people, that's why they don't like batik. For me, that's why I like it. Yeah. I like that as I'm cutting this into three inch sections, sometimes it's going to be that, sometimes it's going to be that. Yeah. I just love the the surprise of it. This one, it seems pretty classic to me. Gorgeous color. Gorgeous, gorgeous color. Gorgeous color. That is the deepest teal I think I've ever seen. It is gorgeous. Oh. Love it. And it is actually... This just feels, looks wet, doesn't it? It does. And it's, oh, that's probably pretty close to what it is. Yeah, it looks like night water. Yeah. I love it. Love it. Oh, I just love that color story. I just I think it's fantastic. You have to figure out what to make out of it. I'm thinking this is definitely why, because mom and I have been not ordering batiks because we have so many, and I think that's probably why we love these. I know. Yeah. yeah it is beautiful. We just love them. Love them. Oh, beautiful. Have to think about which, um, I think it's time to remake the uh, on the fly because uh, mm. we don't have that fabric anymore. <laughs> I feel like it needs to be out of this. Right? That. That'd be really good. Mm-hmm. Love that. There's just every once in a while you get a collection where it's like, oh, okay, you have to throw that in to make it all. No, yeah. these are all just little pods. Am I getting too tall for you? No, it's okay. Look at the purple. Beautiful. And look at this one. Don't you. Really cool. And then what happens is we'll start from here. We're going to go ahead and move these out for just a second because then, um, or yeah. do you want to? I could drop up here. Yeah, we'll just do it that way. You can see Tracy working, putting some kids together. Yes. So here's the blues. And see, I'm going to put this pretty. last one that we picked up. This was the last one that we showed. So you can see that then going from with the teals and the purples right into the blues. And then there's even some light purples here. And look at these little patterns. Really, really pretty. Gets down into almost like a periwinkle. And then this is still, I mean, it's not really white. It's still kind of a parchment mm-hmm. color. But that icy blue. Yeah. Really, really pretty. Beautiful. And then, let's see if we can see these. The golds are going to stick them up here. Up on the top. So yeah. Let's do that. That's right.
And then these are, I don't know, I guess you had to have a little sunshine in there. Another really cool, uh, maybe we'll take out that multicolored one so you can see that one. Yeah, this one? Yeah. Yeah, because see. Well, I was seeing the multi, the pebble one. That's the oh, this one. Oh, right, right, right. But see, again, even looking at this. Yeah, so look at see, just adding the gold see that. in there. Yeah, you can just, there's other, mm -hmm. and this, all of these colors that are in there. So here's that orange. We've seen this chop multiple times. We've seen this one multiple times. Love that. Oh, that's just a really good copper Looks color. Looks like a giraffe. It does. That's just a good color. And this one, yeah, yeah. see, that's one of those multi ones that I think if you're going to look at a little one inch square, you're not going to see that whole thing. But this would be fantastic as a border. Mm -hmm. Even Bring some larger, um, you know, eight inch blocks. If you're doing a three yard yeah. quilt, that would be a perfect focus square yeah. with your other two yards being, you know, coordinating. Yep. And then just a really pretty gold. And Love again, it. that gold color, so you can see in some of these other ones. Oh yeah. It's in here. Beautiful. All right, we're gonna clean it up and then we'll open some more boxes. All right. All right, Maisie's out here terrorizing us. You might hear her for a minute. And in fact, that made me want to share this. Can we share this picture with them? Yeah. <laughs> this was from, uh, I love that. Where's this from? Christy Parker. Christy Parker. Uh, she's very nice. She says, I never miss any of your YouTube episodes. I appreciate that. And I saw this photo, photo and I had to share. <laughs> Love it. So true. Yes. And, Harper uh, needs a warning label. Yes. <sighs> oh, and if you're listening and not watching, the shirt says, I have red hair because I need a warning label. Yeah. <laughs> it's all the truth. Totally true. Totally true. Four, my four red-headed grandchildren. Yes. Oh, I is am this our last one? Oh, no, this no. is a new one. New one. Is this garden <gasps> there is door banners. I Fill forgot to in. tell you. I forgot to tell everyone. Surprise, you heard it here first. <laughs> and um, I think it is only one box. There, there are only, is it a dozen? 12. Mm -hmm. There's only a dozen. So for those of you that have been enjoying the monthly table runners, and they were the table or runners, or you could pillow. turn them into bench pillows, or you could put them um, into, uh, oh yeah, they were bench pillows, but you, you could do, do table runners or, or um, wall hangings. They are now doing door banners. Totally different. Every design is different. Same idea that they're designed by all of the this one's Wecker uh, Fresh. designers. Wecker Fresh is starting us Just up. So same set. idea. It's still in those really cool boxes that are all magnetic closures. Super... Um, Oh, you have to be smarter than the magnet. Mm -hmm. um, uh, super well packaged. All of the fabric is in there. The pa full color pattern is in there. Mm -hmm. And um, um, you get the pa colored pattern and fabric for top and binding. So you have to yeah. provide your own batting and back. Um, and your banner size is 20 by 36. So we can go on a door, be on a wall hanging. You could put it into a quilt, maybe it'd be a ginormous quilt, or you could do a, you know, um, a, a quarterly quilt, you know, four panels in each one. Yeah. Whatever you wanted. It's kind of cool. cool is you think about, you know, some mm -hmm. of our elderly friends that are in apartments oh, or in fun. Um, uh, assisted care facilities mm -hmm. or something. How fun to have something cool on their door that you could change out every month. Or yeah. You know, yeah, kind of fun. So anyway, and if you had several to make, if you got one, you would still end up with a pattern and just out of your stash, you could go ahead and um, do the others. Mm -hmm. The patterns, <coughs> sorry, the patterns are not otherwise available. Yeah. It is only in this kit format. We only have 12 and they're gonna ask, <coughs> sorry, I don't know what happened. I think I swallowed a bug. <laughs> They're gonna ask what the other ones look like. I can send you that. Um, I will put them up. So if you are familiar with the bench pillow one, there might be a few kids that left. Um, I'll put that up in the what's new. But you can so see they all of could them. pre-order. Yeah, let them I'll do have a pre-order option for you guys. <coughs> yeah. And then those of you that um, do uh, pre-order, we'll put a special gift in. Because um, I mean, I could do a coupon code that gives you a percentage off if you buy all twelve. But coupon codes are our kryptonite so <laughs> so if you get i'll prepay for um all 12 of them so you'll get this one shipping this week everything else will be shipped to you as soon as it arrives um and you'll actually get the opportunity to get them having only 12 and 170,000 of you guys watching your odds get slimmer and slimmer 
Yeah. Um, so it gives you the opportunity. But if you um, buy a frontal, we'll send you a special gift. Maybe a coupon later to use. and You'll have time to use it. I have an idea it. of what a fun present would be. We'll give you a good present. We'll give you a good present. A very good present. If you want to do all 12 of them. Yes. And then okay. um, I'll put in the what's new section so you can see all of them. Um, and then I'll do the same thing where it Bye. says ships in Bye. March, ships in um, April, kind of thing. So you kind of know when to expect it. <laughs> Just a dork. <laughs> she walks and she shakes her <laughs> arms and she flails <laughs> in not the right as you're walking. Yeah. I'll work in the jerk. Yeah. <laughs> She's just, she's just so much fun to watch. I know. We need to, we need to have amazing cam. She's uncoordinated for sure. <laughs> she is. All right. Well, that's fun. I uh, fun surprise. Yeah. All right. What's this? Okay. All right, this is um, Henry. Henry Studio E. Puppy faces. Oh, this is cute. It says positively oh, awesome. Positively cute. And a stripe. That's a cute stripe. And there's a whole other um, box. Awesome. I bet All there's right. an adorable panel in here somewhere. If it's Henry Glass. Oh, it? Studio E. Studio there's e. Oh, there's probably a still panel. Okay. Alright, we'll get them all out. Cut off a panel, hopefully, and we'll show you up close. <laughs> so What's this is called? Positively Awesome. P A W. Yeah. 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 <laughs> they can't see yeah, a good little face. Yeah. She's kind of tired. Kinda She's sleepy, kind of Kind of full of it. She keeps throwing yeah. herself backwards. Yeah, we're at that. We're at that stage. And also, where she can get her new trick is she can get on our couch without anybody's help. So she climbs up there last. And giggles. <laughs> she can't get herself down though, so it's quite irritating. <laughs> so Wyatt and Harper now have to stay on the floor with her, so she doesn't want to get up there with them. That doesn't stop her because she thinks she's cool being the only one up there, but. Ah! Whoa! <laughs> Screech. <laughs> we had a good thing going. <laughs> um, so here is. <laughs> so here is the panel. So a little 24 by 42. So you're roughly, you know, a 10 inch block. Perfect if you want to make uh, stars and stripes, of course. And also a cute little border print on the very bottom. Cute. That is really cute. What is that little wiener All dog of the say? dog stuff, though. Let's walk. Yeah. And it's, yeah. All the dog stuff is really cute. And it tends to be pretty popular because of all of us that do things to support local animal shelters. Yes. You know, if you're doing um, fundraisers or whatever, it's always kind Nana of Nana doesn't want to eat that. I know. She wants me to eat it. Nana doesn't eat that. Doesn't want to. All right. Let me show you up close. Okay, let's look. Let's look at the puppies. There's some puppies. Look at these puppies. A really nice modern take on it, too, with yeah. that aqua and teal mm. and gray. Yeah. There's puppies. And a cute little small one. It's tiny. Okay, yeah. there we go. So we've got some puppy faces. You love it. Puppy paws. Um, that's also the exact same piece in the, like, sashing of your panel. Oh, very good. Oh, she's kissing the puppies. And then we've got... Aww. Aww. <laughs> You're so cute. Aww. Aww. You like the puppies? Do you love your puppies? I do. You do like them? Look at these puppies. And then some full, full face puppies. Yeah. And then um, kind of a toss. And then this one is, of course, the... Uh, Fire hydrants. Fire hydrants. And then kind of a fun little toss here. Yeah. And this one. It's and this is not directional. Tail. Fetch, wolf, bark. She cute. A fantastic stripe. Mm -hmm. Could be leashes, could be collars. Yep. Cute. And then this cool one. Yeah, just some all over. Kind of some blocks. Oh, what a bag. Oh, oh, oh. Is it cute? Do you like it? Yeah. Okay, it's Maisie approved. Yeah. Super cute. You like that one. You like the little brown puppy. She huh? like the little brown puppy. You know, it's funny. It's only Lizzie is that color because yeah. Jezebel's white and uh, Rose oh. black. Yeah. 
Do you like Lizzie? You need a little brown puppy? And then Lizzie? All right, we're gonna clean this up and I think we have more boxes. Yeah, more. yeah one more. Okay. okay, two more boxes. Two more. Yeah, QT fabrics. QT. Two more heavy boxes. Yeah. So there's they're big ones. Oh. What you got? Polka dots. Polka dots. Polka dots. Polka dots. Oh, yeah, polka dots. Oh, I love that one. A red. And it's like maybe dime size. Maybe a little smaller. Polka dots. It's some classic. It seems classic. like Riley Blake. QT. It's, yeah. True red. A really good true like colonial blue. A whole different size. Um, more of a pin dot. Oh, great. Look at this gingham. Look how perfect right. that is. It'd be hard to see in plastic. It looks like more like a red, white, and blue kind of a thing going on. Yeah. Okay. It looks like should we uh, take the plastic off and then there's a pattern. Oh, there's some patterns in there. Okay. I know what this is. Surprise! 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 <laughs> is it January? <laughs> it's January. Surprise. Okay, so this is a block of the month thing. We, I, I think it's all the same block. We could do a class. Um, to show yeah, because it looks like the centers like are different. Like, it's all half square triangles. And the centers are different. It is all half square but, triangles. But we're not going to do it as a block of months. Mine is, you know we, why? We, yeah. <laughs> um, we but, do. We sew all the time. Both of us do all the time. But mm -hmm. the idea of staying up with it. It's that idea of filming and getting our block of the month uploaded. Mm -hmm. We're really bad at it. And well, I think that before we, because I'm really behind right now on my Jay's bouquet, you mm -hmm. are behind on, on color, color dance. dance. We will get caught up. Part of it with us is a couple, sort of a trifecta of issues, which was... We all have too many jobs. We have too many jobs. <laughs> and we have a full-time person who is off and has been off since September. Yeah. And then, uh, and then, um the remodel just too many weird little things that yeah, we just um, kind of yeah didn't get caught up um at all but anyway we are going to get caught up when i get back um because that's the other thing is that it takes two of us one to sew mm -hmm. one to film so yeah and then to know. edit so i film i edit i maintain the online store so it's a whole lot and it's a whole lot of excuses and I know. We, just we are so bad. sorry. We're sorry. Thank yeah. you for sewing with us. I hope you're not waiting on us. But this, um, I think that this is really, I just really like yeah, it. Yeah, it's And it's really humongous. Cool. Mm -hmm. Oh, I guess it's not. It's 57 and a half by 74. And they're not really half square triangles. They're making, they're doing, they're making like a the flying geese unit. Like, let me show you this. General you instructions. So they're making um, like ribbon pieces, a rectangle and two, so like a half square triangle thing going on mm. um and then it's your fly geese units um but the pattern's done really well i mean i love the picture back here is your actual ruler and where your line should line up on your ruler um which is super cool to make sure you get your quarter of an inch what are you trimming i love that they're trimming their flying geese unit there's so many patterns out there that they just, and when it's done, it's like my color dance one. When it's done, it should measure two and a half by four. There's no trim. What if room. it doesn't? Right. And I love that they're having a trim. I know some people are like, oh, I hate the trimming part, but it makes it go so much It makes smoother. it all, yeah, line up together. The trimming is not a big deal. So it's a really well-written pattern. I love also on the back is a black and white, like, coloring sheet. Mm -hmm. So if you're not wanting to do the red, white, and blue kit that we're going to do you can get the pattern and then color in your own thing make it scrappy um do a little block swap with your guild people and change out that center block because that looks like the only thing that changes mm -hmm. is i think there's two of each block in the center and then the whole layout the oh the, you know the ribbony bit on the outside is all the same Super I think cool. it's absolutely beautiful. I really, really like it. I also really like a red, white, and blue quilt. Yeah. I think it's just, just There's so something crisp about looking. it. Yeah. And this one, it only has one teeny tiny little striped border. You could add bigger borders. Yeah. You could add more stuff. And we have a lot of other red, white, and blue fun stuff. This is no, there's no flowers in here. It really looks like it's all polka dot, stripe, stripe and gingham. gingham check. And so it's all mm -hmm. fairly, um, um, simple textures. Yeah. So you could add something kind of fun if you wanted to, if you wanted to add a floral or a flag crazy. or something to it. 
I yeah. really like Super it. Super great. And they have um, the anchor mitts are kind of all over the place. I'll try to calculate it for you because it's funny. They do it individually. Like for month one, whatever block you're making for month one, you need three quarters of a yard of your background, three eighths of these three checks and an eighth yard of the polka dots, um, which makes sense for like a quilt store point of view. We can individually kit your months for you. So you can come in, do some shopping, take month one home. Here's all your pieces. Come in, get month two or whatever. But for those of us just sewing at home from stash or getting a kit, um, there's a few more um, information, a little bit more information. And I think too, um, we used to do that for a long time for the first probably... In 10, 12 years that we were in business, we did mm -hmm. blocks of the month that way where we cut all the blocks a month, you'd come in, you know, the first month. And then what yeah. happens sometimes is after three months, somebody gives up. It's like, yeah, I'm not going back, I'm not getting the rest of my stuff. Well, nobody wants to buy your block number four through 12. Yeah. And so, um, and so, it's like, wait, wait, we wait. Too many times. Yeah. So, and so it really is better for us, better for most quilt shops. And that's why they charge you. It's like, well, you're going to pay for the last two. Because we know you're going to come and get them, and you're going to play that, pay that. Um, there's like a twenty-five dollar registration mm -hmm. fee or whatever. We don't do any of that. It's like, listen, it's the whole kit, yeah. And it's exactly what you would pay for the fabric. So you get all of the fabric, you get the pattern, work on it the way that you want to. It doesn't matter. Mm -hmm. And if for some reason you decide I'm done, I am sticking with these three blocks that I you made. You put it in the local guild yard sale. Yeah, and you sell that bad boy. <laughs> or <laughs> see, I do something different. Those three blocks, I am going to turn into a table runner, and I'm using the rest of that fabric for something else. <laughs> that too is a brilliant yeah. idea. Yeah. But this is super cute. This I feel really like I cute. would make this. Mm -hmm. And they really do do a good job on your. It's not just half row triangles. So it's we're gonna, block. we're gonna. I can say this because I'm leaving uh, <laughs> tomorrow, tonight, tonight. As far as you're concerned tomorrow for me. Um, so these people here are going to cut these into cut kits. kits for you. And so we'll, we'll have, have kits, kits and just patterns. Um, I don't know what number yet. It depends on how many patterns I have and what I have for yardage after I calculate it all. But um, either way, whether you want to make it just like this one and you love this one, it's going to have yeah. um, maybe a solid white or we'll finish opening the box. Maybe there's some I white in think here. that there's, um, I can see here, we've got, um, we have Ooh, a little white multiple white on different, white. yeah, all of these patterns, the polka dot, the stripe, the check, uh -huh. are in a white on white. Ooh, so this is fun. a teeny tiny little polka dot. So yeah, we'll have it all ready for you if you want to make it just like this or you can pick and choose because you just want to add the colors to your stash or you're making your own red, white, and blue quilt and you can buy that or get the pattern and make it out of whatever you want. And I lied. Uh, it's all, they're not all different. It's, it's all, all the dot. same. It's all polka dot. It's all the teeny. It it's, all it's looks smaller. Just like this. It's smaller. smaller. It's like than this. Dot. Yeah. White on white. So Cute. that is the back. And it looks to me like we have five bolts of this. Yeah, my so guess is it's going to be cut the probably kids. five yards of background. Yeah. All right, um, we're going to get the rest of it out. To, yeah, we'll show you. Because um, I feel like you need the plastic taken off because of the stripes and the dots. So oh. we'll take the plastic off, show you the colors, um, and let you see everything. Okay, this is really nice. It's just a really nice yeah. classic. Red, white, and blue. You know, <clears throat> it is important that we have to cut these kits fairly quickly because this is that kind of fabric that's just classic. It'll go quickly yeah. anyway. And I dots mean, and stripes. What's awesome? This to love? is the perfect Mickey Mouse fabric right mm -hmm. here. This mm -hmm. is perfect um, summer picnic fabric. And just any it's blue just nice. and white sailboat quilt. I mean, yeah. And it's that crisp, clear blue. It mm -hmm. is a pure navy blue, pure white, pure red. Just classic Fantastic. colors. So. I love that they threw in a little bit of the gray. I know. I kind of like that for a little modern take yeah. or maybe you're just looking for some gray and white to add to your stash. So yeah. super cool. Um, what was it? It's called, oh, it's called Dots and Stripes. Dots and Stripes. Dots and Stripes. Oh, this original. Come on. Someone tried real hard, okay? Come on. We could have come up with a better name than that. <laughs> right? <laughs> Sailor's Day Out, man. Something. Something. But yeah, a really good Yeah, it's mix. just really nice. It's just, you know, nothing fancy schmancy. Let's just start from over here. So there's okay. just that really thin stripe, which is just probably really nice. Probably half inch. Yeah, probably. And then a little small check. You'll see a little bit later there's a bigger check. Little polka dot. Here's the small check and the big check. See the difference? Really nice gingham. Really nice. Small dot. Mickey Mouse dot right there. Mm -hmm. Pretty classic. Stripe, stripe. And then this one, oh yeah, white on red. The other one was red on white. Here is the blue on white. Over here you have the white on blue. And again, the small check, big check. Big polka dot, little polka dot. So really, it's just 
Yeah, that's the it. same ones. Yeah. And, and then, then there's the, oh, white. I'm sorry, because we're blended and in. And you can't really see it. It's just a tiny little pin dot. It's just smaller, tiny, smaller than smaller. that, mm-hmm. but just a cute little texture. You can barely see it. Without my glasses on, I can't see it. We'll read solid. Mm-hmm. And if you do something, you want something super, super solid, just a Kona solid white. Yeah. Nothing crazy. Yeah. All righty. All right. All right. Well, I just have to say, my goodness. So uh, we mentioned this morning in Fabric Chat that we have decided for sure we are going to do a second bag retreat. Um, the dates will be on the website, but mm-hmm. it is essentially um, we allow for uh, Wednesday is kind of a travel day. Everybody arrives mm-hmm. on Wednesday, spend the night and then um Everything starts, our instruction is all day Thursday, all day Friday, all day Saturday. We make three different projects. We have Mm -hmm. um, a couple of different trunk shows uh, that will be there. You'll have kits um, available. And what will happen is you'll make a bag um, and it'll have increasing difficulty as we go so that you learn how to put in a zipper, do a handle, do your box bottoms, um, multiple different um, fabrics that we'll be using. And then you have your evenings to make another one, do something from the trunk show, work on your own project that you're bringing, whatever you'd like to do. Mm-hmm. Um, and then um, Sunday, we kind of say goodbye. Some people like to arrive a day early because they're traveling from far away. But again, that's what Wednesday is for. So, you know, you feel like you're probably okay with that depending mm-hmm. upon what time you arrive. And there's more details on the website and your price includes um, all of your instruction, your patterns, your um, all of your food, your lodging, mm-hmm. everything. You just got to get to us. I think that there is a kit fee for the bag class, I yeah. think. I'll have don't, to I don't know if I have it listed or is anything. 65 yet. or something like yeah. that. There is a kit fee because we have everything ready for you, so you don't have to go, oh, mm-hmm. but what size zipper is that? Oh, wait, um, how do I so find a D-ring? What's, yeah, so. what's also nice is if you want to come bring some other projects but just learn some bag-making skills, mm-hmm. perfect. If you yeah. are someone who wants to learn some skills but you've started a few and you want to finish them or you're stuck at a certain oh, part, so or you have a slew of patterns and you're going to bring them all and decide, which one you're going to do, that too is perfect. Um, we are beyond casual when it comes to yeah. any of the retreats. We want you to have fun and do whatever yeah, we you want to do, even if that's just hanging out and sipping coffee. Um, yeah. It doesn't matter. Yeah. Um, <laughs> the only thing you do need to know is um, the sale of the that bag retreat will go on Sunday's box opening at 1230. Um, when we talked about this last week, um, we had anybody who was super interested, um, totally wanted to know, we have an email out to the people who are on the waiting list. They will get first dibs to sign up just because it's in order of who's standing in line. Yeah. Just like the DMV, uh, doesn't matter that you have to pick up your kids, you're still sixth you're, in line. Uh, yeah. So uh, if you're um, number 54. Oh. Yeah. So um, we're just giving you the preempt to look at that, um, check out that, and um, it will go on sale um, Sunday at 1230. Yeah. But for right now, for these next three days, those people have dibs. Um, to see if they want to do yeah. it. So, yeah. So we'll see what happens. But anyway, I'm super excited that it was so popular. I know. I think it'll be fun. I like that. We're excited. We're working on getting some trunk shows. Mm-hmm. Some trunk shows we can't get because they don't do trunk shows, which is sad. But have you seen them? I've still been haranguing them. I know they should. I mean, we have a lot of. <coughs> so we're we trying to get samples. aunties too. Aunties too. But I think we have about 10 of theirs. Yeah. So we're so, still trying to ask. Mm, maybe we not. have I really, um, really by love Annie. Them. She's super easy. We, yeah. We're doing that one. Um, who else? Uh, Pickle, Pink Sand Beach. Pink Sand Beach. We love them. We think they're kind of down. Um, but aunties mm-hmm. too is the one we really, really want. And I think but, I really want it now because she said no. I know. I know. That's why you probably like, wait, what? want it. <laughs> she said that they used to do trunk shows, and trunk shows is when they send us the samples and say, yeah. oh, here's the pattern, and let me just have one already made for you so you don't have to spend the time pre-making it before you go, oh, she made it back she out. She escaped. <laughs> She's She'll come and say goodbye. Um, but uh, she said that they used to do trunk shows, and then they sometimes just wouldn't even get their stuff back. Wow. Or That's too bad. bad. Yeah. Ruined or, Ruined or damaged or... What do you have in your mouth? Uh, I don't know. Oh, Never. she's eating a sticker. But yeah, so that was super exciting. Super fun. Yeah. All right, and then also, you guys, will well, you kind of see me? I won't see you, but... Yeah, uh, she'll be sending me snippets of her um, excursions and traveling and fun stuff that I'll be putting at the end of maybe Fabric Chat or Box Opening so you guys, we can kind of live through her vicariously. I'm excited. I'm excited. Yeah. It'll be fun. All right, I'm going to miss the babies. Yes, yeah, she is. She's already called I her. paid $50. Fifty dollars <laughs> to be able to FaceTime. <laughs> to be able to FaceTime the babies. Ooh. Oh, are you liking this one too? 
I yeah, do. I can see the baby in the screen, though. <laughs> I want that baby. <laughs> Say bye. Say bye-bye. Bye. 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 Thank you for watching our video. We invite you to leave a comment, hit the like button, or better yet, subscribe to our channel so you never miss an episode. You can also visit our Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, or Pinterest pages, or find all of those things and our online store at fabricpatch.net.